Right, welcome back to the channel. I uh, hope everyone is doing well. This video is a little bit informative. I don't usually do these sort of videos, but this one I think is going to apply to quite a lot of people. Um, it's something I've been quite interested in for a while. If you're in the market for any thermal imaging cameras or devices to see a bit of thermal imaging, which works perfect for us plumbers, locating pipes in walls, checking underfloor heating, what I do a lot of is system flushes and it'd be perfect for if you've got a cold rad or even just a rad in general get the thermal camera have a look at the rad see the heat at the top and usually you'll see that arc at the bottom of cold in within that rad and then obviously you're going to flush the system through and you'll be able to see what's what and hopefully it's working so i've been looking for one of these for a while and fortunately hick micro got in touch with me if you can see that hick micro got in touch with me and said would you be interested in having a look at one of our products and uh, giving it a bit of review and putting it out on your channel and we shall give you a bit of a discount code that you can pass on to your subscribers so i said yeah sent me one out haven't even opened it yet we'll open it up now take a look at it see what's in the box see what it's all about and then later on in the video i shall give it a bit of a go and tell you exactly what it's like how it works film how it's doing it and this that and the other so let's get it open literally just sort of picked it up so we'll get it open and have a look see what's in there so yeah first off it this one is before i open it up it's a which one's this one e1 al camera resolution 160 by 120 i think that is the actual sort of heat sources and whatnot it can pick up i might be wrong but that's what i think it is runtime eight hours charging up these fully rechargeable plug it in completely rechargeable let's get it open and see what's going on inside see what we've got so what have we got first uh handheld thermal camera calibration certificate so if you can see that comes with a calibration certificate so you know the readings you're getting a spot on instruction book now this is where i usually go wrong you should always read the instruction book but we'll get it all out first and have a look to be fair it's only two two pages and it looks like on the front there you've got a barcode just there that you can scan and i assume that will give you yeah give you the complete user manual for it so we've got that little case um here it is let's have a look in that first i assume this is going to be the charger yeah charging cable usb charging cable and different adapters for different plugs which is what you expect in one of these boxes and here it is let's take a look there it is e1al thermal camera this one will read from minus 20 to 550 degrees so it's got you covered basically a uh, little wrist strap on it which is perfect what you want you don't want to be dropping something like that sd comes with an sd card so what you can do with these i have read up a little bit on them what you can do with these is you can sort of have a look at what you want say there's a radiator there with a hot hot at the top cold at the bottom you can press a button on here and it will take a screenshot of that image you can plug the camera then into your laptop your computer upload the image and then you've got it you know if you want to pass it on to the customer or whatnot but also what i'll do obviously what i'll do in my videos is film put it into position, film from behind, and, and show you exactly what it's like. But yeah, it's a nice little handheld thing. Little trigger there. Um, let's turn it on and see what's going on. Yeah, so you can see there. Yeah, if I look in the front of it, don't know if you can see my face, don't know if it's showing up. But yeah, looks pretty good. So what I'll do is I'll give this a bit of a go. If I, well, if I just turn it round there, I'm filming my GoPro camera with it. So I think if you press that, yes, that takes a, a shot of it you go to the menu picture yeah so i've just taken that picture of the the gopro i don't know if you'll be able to see it but yeah it just shows you how warm the gopro is inside and all that sort of stuff but yeah nice little tool and these are dead handy if you've watched that video from the other night where i've got an issue with um a blending valve so basically i've gone to a customer's house and they, they've got an issue the hot tap isn't getting hot water coming through it's just lukewarm so there's going to be a blending valve somewhere now i'm struggling to find where this blending valve is this is going to be absolutely perfect for me to go around in fact i'm going to probably do it this week i'm going to go around 
with this thermal imaging camera and just see if I can find exactly where the blending valve is with this. It'd be a nice little test for it. So I'll give that a go and I will do a video on it in a, in a couple of weeks time. But this video, I just wanted to give you the basics of it. So yeah, pretty good camera, fully charged. These will last for eight hours. It go, as I said, it goes from, it'll pick up anything from minus 20 up to 550 degrees. And these are accurate to 2%. So you know exactly where you're gonna be at with it. Also, when you're using it, if you pull the trigger, it will give you a laser. So say you wanna get the top of a rad, instead of just sort of seeing the area, you pull the trigger, you get a little crosshair on the screen but on the actual rad itself will be a little red dot, a laser dot, and that is the actual point that's taking that temperature. But I'll show you later on, I'll go in, I'll go into my house and film my radiators and you can see exactly the temperature, what I'm on about. Right, so that is the radiator in my hallway. So I've just turned the heating on, it's only been on, I don't know, five minutes or so. So let's have a look at how we're looking. Through. So you can see that crosshair in the middle. If I pull the trigger, you can see on the wall, that's the laser. So if I point that to the top left corner of the rad, you see the crosshair. So that's telling us that top left corner is 38 degrees. And then at the bottom, let's put the laser onto the bottom. If we look at it, 29 degrees. So yeah, so, and you can literally see it as it's coming through now from the top into the coolest part at the minute is down there also you're picking up the pipes as well going up in the corner so yeah so the top you've got the actual temperature and obviously on the scale on the right hand side is i suppose it's your temperature scale isn't it yeah so that that rad is literally coming on but that's what it looks like using it as a tool that's what it looks like and then this is a radiator that's took behind my sofa most of the time. So as you can see, the pipe's coming down the back there. And you can see a nice uniform display of heat. So it's colder at the bottom, obviously. It's coming on, 29 degrees. And then at the top, 45, 46 degrees. But these things like this, they're perfect for fault finding, I say finding pipe working walls. Electricians even use them for obviously heat temperature through the through the cables and that. And I think even you know car garages have it. If you've got a if you've got a brake disc that's stuck, this will tell you which one's getting up to temperature, which one isn't. This is going to be one of them tools that if you've got it in your van, you'll find yourself using it quite a lot. So price-wise, this one is like 299 plus the VAT. I'm gonna get 15% off. So I will bang a link in the description below. So if you're interested in one of these, take a look in the link. But what Hick Micro also do is a small mini one unit that plugs into your bottom of your smartphone, but also Hick Micro have got an app that will obviously relay the data from that, th that small thermal imaging camera into your phone so you can screen record it and it's always good. It's a great selling point for your customer. If you're walking around your customer's house and they've got a cold radiator and you can pick it up with this or you can pick it up with the small mini one and they can physically see what you're on about with that cold spot on the bottom of the radiator then all of a sudden you've sorted the valve out or you've flushed the system then the whole radiator then is completely up to temperature the customer's got confidence in exactly what you've done you know and i know we're going to sort the problem out but when the customer can physically see it that's perfect. But yeah, thanks to Hick Micro for sending that out. I will be doing a few videos. I'll try and get the blending valve one so you can see exactly it in real life. And again, with my discount code, if you know you don't want to spend that much on one of those ones, you can get one of the smaller mini ones. Again, I'll put the link in the description below. You get 15% off that. Thanks to Hick Micro for sending this out. Um, good bit of kit. Looks really nice, nice in the hand, nice and light, perfect for the van. Stick it in the box, keep it in the van. And they're just dead handy to have. I think once you've got one, you'll find yourself using it a lot. But what I will do is I'll try and get back to that job with the blending valve and hopefully use it there. Thermal imaging cameras, I think a lot of plumbers now, heating engineers are, are using these as a go-to source of information. Again, if you've got pipe work in the floor, be perfect for tracing that. And also with that barn renovation I've just done, when we fire the underfloor heating up, that's going to look amazing from above. You'll be able to see the loops through the screen and through the tiles. But as I said, I'll pop the link in the description below to the Mini One and to this, the E1L, with a 15% off. Uh, if you're interested in them, go and take a look. 
and save you a few quid. So, big shout out to Hick Marco for sending that out. I'm looking forward to giving it a proper real world plumbing review out on a few jobs that I'm going to be doing. But as I said, hit the link below, 15% off. You got the Mini One and the E1L. Both look really good units. So, hope you found this informative. And thanks for watching. Hit the like button, hit the subscribe button, and I shall catch you all soon.